What's up, Pisces gang? Thank you so much for joining me today. Thank you so much for clicking on this video. If this is your first time here, I am Quisha here with Abundant Healing. I was sent here from the universe to give you guys some good messages, some good readings, some good love, some good healing, some good vibes. You know, I was sent here to give it to you. And that's exactly what I am doing. Today, we are doing your daily money reading, guys. Yes. If this is your first time to this channel, we do these readings daily honey this is the millionaire pisces club and if you want to go on this road to millions with us over here go ahead and hit the subscribe button honey because we would love to have you here remember if anything in this video resonated with you guys i invite you to leave me a comment smash that like button that would also let me know thank you guys so much for all the likes comments subscribes appreciate you guys so much if you want to say thanks, then you can hit, click the super thanks below this video, or you can support the channel by going to the link in the description box, AbundantHealingShops.com. Everything is buy one, get one free. <laughs> so go check it out, guys. All right, without further ado, let's jump into your money reading. Hope everyone is having a beautiful day today. It's a little rainy on my side of the world, but you know, it's still a beautiful day. <laughs> All right, universe, what messages can I give the beautiful Pisces collective in regards to money, in regards to their career, in regards to their finances? What messages can I give the beautiful Pisces collective today, universe, in regards to their money, in regards to their finances, in regards to their career? Thank you, universe. Okay. All right, Pisces, three of pentacles at the bottom, followed by the eight of swords and the five of cups uh, with the hanged one at the top, followed by the ace of wands and the four of cups. All right, Pisces. So you have been, you've been working, like you've been, So, what I'm getting, Pisces, is that someone here may have a lot of things that they want to do. You have a lot of things that you want to do. You know, maybe you have a job. Maybe you want to start a business. You know, maybe, you know, you have a job. Maybe you want to find another job. You know, maybe you have a business. Maybe you want to start another business. Maybe you have um a career and maybe you're interested in something else so someone here has a lot of things that they want to do um, a lot of motivation to do um, a lot of things here um, a lot of creative things too like this is like you are being creative with these things and you're very um, passionate about these things that you're that you're wanting to do and you can do whatever you want to do Pisces like you the the world is yours. Like you can do whatever you want to do. When I say that, I mean that you can create your own reality by your thoughts. Okay. Your thoughts can create whatever type of reality you want to create for yourself. Okay. Because everything that is manifested on this planet started with a thought. Okay. So remember that, remember that, you know, if you're passionate, if you're passionate about something, you're going to go far. Okay. Now, if you're not passionate about something, you can gather some money. You can, you know, you can, you could survive, but for something to have longevity, for something to last for a long time, the passion has to be there. The passion has to be there. And when you find your passion, Pisces, because it seems like you've been doing a lot, like you've been you know, you've been fighting a lot of battles. You've been, you've been going through a lot and you've been doing it by yourself. Like if you can see this, this lady, she is like, she's, she has this one and she's already got six and she got this one up and she's not like letting anyone come and take her, her wands. Like she's protecting herself. She's standing her ground. Okay. So you have been standing your ground. And you have been, you know, you, like you've been very 
successful. I'm not going to say like you have accumulated the type of wealth that you want, that you dream of, but you've been good. Like you've been, you've been straight, but there's still some things that you want to accomplish. There's still some things that strike your interest. There's still some things that you want to do. There's still some streams of income that you want to generate, that you want to bring into your environment. And you could do that. But Pisces, you got to get out of your own way. You got to get out of your own head. Because what I'm getting is that someone has been second guessing yourself. You've been second guessing yourself a lot. Like, is this going to work? I want to do this, but is this going to work? Got to stop second guessing yourself. Okay. You just got to let the thoughts just come in and, and you have to follow your intuition and your instinct. Okay, Pisces, because your the the streams of income are gonna come, but you gotta make sure that you are being strategic with this. You gotta make sure that you are doing the necessary planning that you need to do. Okay, because it's hard to juggle more than one thing at one time. Maybe someone here even has to change their perception on the way that. You're looking at a situation. I need some more details. Give me one second, guys. Give me one second. Hey, do I tell me more? You want to do that. <laughs> tell me more, universe, in regards to the Pisces money, in regards to their finances, their jobs. Please clarify these cards. Thank you, universe. Let's see, Pisces. Okay. <laughs> okay. Thank you, universe. Five of Cups. So, yeah, you, it's like you've been second guessing yourself. Okay. All right, Pisces. So you have been like you you've been standing your ground, like I said. Um, but you've also been doing some deep soul searching. You've also been like researching, you've been meditating, and now is a beautiful time to meditate, guys. The full moon is in Pisces. And now is a really beautiful time for us to tap into our spiritual selves and to um, really get the clarity that we desire or that we need for meditation. So remember to uh, meditate and ask God for clarity and listen, because with prayer, with meditation comes answers, comes clarity. OK, so that is one way you can kind of figure this thing out, because I feel like you are wanting to do something else you there is some other type of spark of interest that you have that you want to do but you've been second your you've been second guessing yourself with this situation but there has to be a balance okay so someone here is juggling a lot of things at one time maybe you have a lot of passions maybe you have a lot of um drive maybe you like i said in the beginning maybe there is someone here who has a job or want to start a business or maybe you have a business and you want to start another business or you want to add more stuff like you're you're trying to do a lot here okay and you've been doing a great job with holding up your end of the bargain or just standing your ground and just making sure that everything is done in the correct way um but what what the universe is telling me to tell you pisces is that there is a balance okay there is clarity all right, you have the chariot here coming in very fast, right on top of the Knight of Swords. And both of these cards are telling me that um, something is coming in fast. Whatever it is, it's coming in fast. If it's money, it's coming in fast. If it's uh, clarity, it's coming in fast. If it's multiple streams of income, it's coming in fast. Like it's coming in very fast, Pisces, for you. Whatever this is, it's coming in fast. So, um... You have to stay balanced though, okay? You got to stay balanced. And also what the universe is telling me to tell you guys is that this new way of getting money that you are trying to implement into your daily routine or into your career or into your job, whatever it is, there does need to be um, 
some due diligence. So just make sure that you are, are um, researching. Just make sure that you are learning about this, uh, whatever it is that you're trying to do. Make sure that you are putting the necessary tools, um, sorry, the necessary um, things in place in order for you to grow from this. Because it, there's like, it's like some, you just got to change your perception. I, I, I'm, I'm not, I need this to be clarified. I need this to be clarified. Can you clarify the five of swords for me, universe? Please clarify the five of swords. I'm not really sure exactly what is going on with the five of swords. Okay. So, thank you, universe. Okay. So you don't, okay, thank you universe. So you don't want to put too much on yourself, Pisces. So you have all these things and you have, you know, multiple things of, um, you know, most, blah, 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 excuse me. What I'm trying to say is you have options to generate multiple streams of income, okay? You have options to um, do more than one thing at one time, but the universe is, telling you or what the universe wants you to know Pisces is that um you don't want to put too much on yourself that you can't bear okay don't pick up too much don't overwork yourself with all of these things that you have going on as you can see this lady with this ten of wands she has all of these passions and all of these desires and all these creative ideas and she's trying to get them over the other side of the road but it's too much to carry so what you're so what with this on top of the five of swords is telling me that you don't want to put too much on yourself don't overthink pisces don't overthink don't over analyze the situation okay just stick to the basics don't overdo it okay remember to trust your intuition be practical, be analytical about it, but also trust your intuition, Pisces. Don't put too much on yourself, okay? And make sure that you are communicating the way that you think and the way that you feel to other people that you may be doing business with, that you may, you know, work with. Make sure that you are communicating um, in a very um, respectful way because, you know, what I'm seeing is that someone is doing a lot of overthinking and you're trying to do too much at one time and maybe someone is feeling like, you know, like you're not doing a good job. So don't, you're, you're not doing a good job at what it is that you're supposed to be doing. Okay. So don't put too much on yourself, Pisces. I know this is a lot. I'm kind of all over the place because I'm, I'm getting like a lot of messages are coming in. Um, a lot of messages are coming in. So this reading is kind of like, <laughs> we are in Mercury retrograde, so <laughs> there's a lot of it's a it's a lot of something that's coming in right now. I feel like maybe someone is like it's confused. Someone is confused, and you know you're trying to you're trying to you're trying to express yourself, but you're coming off to other people as misunderstood or confused. Okay, don't overthink this though. Don't overthink this situation. Don't overthink this. Um, just don't overthink, okay, Pisces? Remember to, to tap into your spiritual self. Remember to tap into um, the spiritual world. Meditate. Ask for clarity, okay? See what your thoughts and try to analyze the, your thoughts. Don't let your thoughts consume you. Be practical. You know, follow your intuition, though. All right, tell me more, Pisces. I mean, universe. Why do I keep saying this? Tell me more, Pisces. <laughs> I guess that's what somebody else is saying. Yeah, tell me more, Pisces, because I all I say that every time. <laughs> tell me more, universe. All right, what more can I give the beautiful Pisces collective? What more can I give the beautiful Pisces collective? The healer. Can y'all see this beautiful illustration? It's so beautiful. 
So this card says, I am loving and compassionate and able to bring healing to others. So Pisces, you are a healer. Someone here wants to heal. Someone here wants to help others. So maybe these, um, or maybe someone here wants to start a business in regards to crystals like me. <laughs> um, so someone here is a healer. Someone here um, wants to help other people, but it's like you, you're, you're, there's a lot of going, you're confused as to what to do on how to do it. Okay. So you're confused on how to live your, um, live out your purpose and still have responsibility. Okay. There's some confusion when it comes to trying to find the balance with this. Okay. Pisces. But what the universe wants you to know, Pisces, that you can always come to the universe and ask for clarity. You can always sit and meditate and, and sit and, and um, sit with your thoughts and just listen. And the universe or God, whatever you want to call it, is going to give you the answers that you need. Okay? Because there are a lot of spiritual beings always here, always looking to help us, looking to lend a hand, looking to clarify some things that we don't understand. Okay, Pisces? So you can always tap into that. You can always tap into that. Do not forget to meditate. Meditate, meditate, meditate. Breathe throughout the day. Take a couple deep breaths. Inhale. Exhale. Because I feel like someone here has a lot of anxiety. Someone here has a lot of thoughts running through their minds all day long. And it's kind of hard to just, you know, put these thoughts in their file cabinets and, and organize your mind. So the universe wants you to know, Pisces, to meditate, center yourself, and, and just always remember you can come back to center. Don't put too much on yourself. Don't overthink, okay? Remember to meditate. That was the message that I had for someone here. Okay, remember to meditate. And and sometimes you got to go in solitude. Sometimes you just got to be by yourself. Take some time by yourself and meditate. Okay, that is what I have for you today, Pisces. Thank you so much for joining me today. Thank you so much if you made it through this whole video. I really appreciate you guys so much. If anything in this video resonated with you, I invite you to leave me a comment. Smash that like button. That will let me know that something in this video resonated with you. Thank you guys so much for being here. If you are a true Pisces, you want to go on this journey, you can hit the subscribe button. I would love to have you here. Thank you so much. If you want to support the channel more, AbundantHealingShops.com. The link is in the description. I will definitely put a link to the um, this ring that you guys have been asking about. I will do. I will put that in the description as well. So thank you guys so much. That is what I have for you today. I love each and every one of you guys. And I hope you're having a beautiful day. Bye.